I've returned. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> now, if you're new here, thank you for joining me, appreciate that. For those who've already been here, I know it's been a hot minute since I've been here. I think the last video I made was probably like a month or two ago. I was like showing my hair. Oh, yeah, she's in blonde, clean now, don't look at the roots. They look like shit, actually my whole hair looks good. I hope you're all doing well. I'm here with a haul. So I've been shopping for the past few days. I thought I'd do a little haul for you guys on a few bits that I've been buying for like autumn, winter and everything. So I live in the UK, I live in London and now in our second day of lockdown, which is I'm so happy. Let's not talk about it. I'm going to spend my time here entertaining you guys with all the money that I've been spending. There's a few things I've got from Brandy Melville, Zara, and of course the lovely and amazing Fendi. If you're new here, you know, please join the fam, hit that subscribe button so you can see more videos that I'll be posting. I promise I'll be posting a lot more. Hit that like button if you like this video and let me know in the comments down below if, or anything else that you'd want me to do. So yeah, let's get on with the video. First things first, I'm gonna go with the, uh, I'll go with the, oh god, god I'm sweaty, you making me nervous. Anyway, stuff is all right. Sarah, so these are a few things that I've probably bought over time, it's probably like things I've bought recently and then over the past few weeks, I guess. First thing I got was this really cute jacket, sh jacket, jacket, jacket. Like a shirt jacket, yeah. So it's like really thick, super cute. If any of you guys have TikTok, I've seen loads of people like doing like uh, what Zara's currently got in stock. I've seen loads of these jackets online. Um, absolutely obsessed with it. So cute. Love the colours. I think the colourway is really nice. Love the material. It's like a thick wool material. Definitely keeps you warm. Um, I've worn it a few times. I'm not gonna lie, I've like every day. But um, you've worn it in the rain. It's been pretty good. She cute, I like it. It's oversized, like boyfriend fit. This in a small, I think it's around $49.99, which is pretty good. The next thing I got from Zara was this really cute ribbed top. Uh, it's, it's not cropped, it just comes past the belly button, full sleeves, super cute. Got this in a small as well. Love the color, it's like a burnt orangey burgundy color. Got a really cute square neck which is really nice when you want to show your decolletage. I think it looks really cute. Definitely keeps you warm as well. This was around 20 pounds. <sighs> Decent again. Okay, and the other thing I got from Zara, which is another top, is this long sleeved brown, I'd say it's ripped as well top. Super cute, love the colors, love the color. I think the color is so lush, it's like a cold chocolatey color. Um, warm as well, looks so nice and I think it'll look so cute with the different variation of outfits. I've got some creamy, nudey coloured type of jeans from Weekday that I think they look really cute with. Just some like simple boyfriend jeans, a top that you can definitely dress up and dress down and wear casually along with that one too. This one I also got in a small and was £15.99 which is not bad. The final thing that I got from Zara that I'm absolutely obsessed with, she cute, is this absolutely stunning warm fleecy coat jacket thing um you can see the material is like fleece it's got really cute like these like wooden style buttons and leather pockets love the detailing the collar up here as well so cute i literally saw some of that different zara's have like like a variation of different things i managed to pick this one up from zara in chelsea oh i absolutely love it literally the day i got it i started wearing it straight away so warm so soft so comfy it's so cute same again definitely coat you can wear dress up and dress down got this one in a medium i wanted to get something a bit more slightly uh baggy so i could wear like jumpers and stuff underneath to wear like a lot of like um casual clothes with these i wore it with like a jumper and some joggers and looked so cute get out of the way okay so next we'll go to is Andy melville 
anyone knows me, I love, love, love Brandy Marvel. Obviously, I'm obsessed with their clothes. So cozy, so comfy. Now, I'm not your typical Brandy Marvel type of girl. Not the skinniest person. There are a lot of their clothes that definitely don't fit me. So I stay away from them. Okay, so the first thing I managed to pick up was this really cute, big, baggy, baggy cream t-shirt. Oh, it's like a oversized baggy type of fit. It looks really cute on, so nice. I've been wearing these with boyfriend, um, not boyfriend, with um, mum jeans, or you can even wear it with joggers. Definitely look really nice with that. This one was probably about 20 pounds, I think. I also managed to pick up the same style t-shirt, but like a different print. So this one, got like a, I got like a real 80s kind of vibe, 90s vibe from it. But it was really cute. This one was black. This one came in around the same price as well. The other thing I got was a really cute little vest top. It says Hawaii on it. The Hawaii print on this one is actually stitched. I think it's such a nice colour. I find that definitely like whenever you go to Brandy Melville, the colour and like the style of their clothes, you can definitely tell it's Brandy Melville. I'm obsessed with this blue shade. I think it looks so cute on. I've been wearing this mostly with their joggers. These are the joggers that I've been wearing them with. It's really cute. Got a New York print there. Cuffed leg at the bottom. These ones I say a bit more like, like a ripped material, not like your normal general tracksuit jogger type of material, which I really like. They're super warm, so comfy. I literally wore these two together with the Zara jacket on top and oh, I was obsessed. It looks so good. This jogger bottoms I got in a space one size. I've got to put everything's one size. <laughs> anyway, so these jogging bottoms I got, I think they were around about £30, I think, those ones were. I've got another pair of jogging bottoms. These are more of like a washed out blue material. These ones say Newport Beach. Super cute, once again, cuffed at the bottom. These also look so cute on. These ones definitely have more of the normal tracksuit material with the like fleecy material on the inside. So cute on the fitting on these are really nice. I like the Brandy Marvel jump bottoms because I feel like I'm five foot four, so I'm not that tall. And the way that they cuff at the bottom are the perfect length. I feel like I really struggle with some jumper bottoms where the sizing is just so bad, or like they're cuffed but they're just too baggy or just too long for me. So I'm a fan. Okay, so the next thing I got from Brandy was this really cute cropped long sleeved knitted cardigan. I've been wearing this more like a top underneath, do your buttons up, I'll probably like leave like one button to undone at the top, um, have some jewellery on, a few necklaces, it looks so cute. I've been wearing these with mum jeans, once again, something you can definitely dress up and dress down. Love the colour, I love the navy blue shade, um, such good quality as well. I think this one ranged around, I actually can't remember the price, so I'll see if I can find everything online and put all the links down below for you guys to go check that out. <laughs> final thing I got from Brandy was this really cute um, long sleeve like kind of baggy t-shirt also says Newport Beach on it goes really well with the jogging bottoms the colours slightly off but I wore them together and they look so nice on such a comfy outfit I'd say that's probably more of like casual wear especially when we're going into like another lockdown if you guys are looking for good loungewear I definitely hit Brandy Marvel and check that out oh my god so I also forgot to mention I got this really, really cute, also from Brandy Marvel, this adorable grey hoodie, which is like this. It's got London printed on it in green. Grey hoodie jumper, so cute. It's oversized baggy hoodie. I have looked everywhere for a really cute baggy hoodie and I've just never been able to find like, the right like, find one that fits well or how I want it to fit, like the perfect like baggy style. Um, this one fits perfectly. You can literally probably even wear it like a jumper dress if you wanted to. Um, but I've been literally wearing these with jumper bottoms, like mum jeans again. You can wear it with skinny jeans and they look really cute. One, I'm obsessed with this jumper. I've literally been living this one and that one. I'm literally living in it these days. I've got nowhere to go, you know, so <laughs> you might as well just live in the lounge that you've got. So I've literally just been like, living up in this hoodie. It's so cozy, so warm. Oh, perfect. I think this one came up around £32, which I think was a great, great price. Onto the final bougie section of this video. 
I went down to Fendi, went down to New Bond Street in London. Honestly, I absolutely love that street. They've literally already put the Christmas lights on, it looks so cute. So I went down there, um, was generally having a look around to update my jewellery that I've got. So I went and I managed to find these really cute Fendi earrings. So adorable, perfect size. Originally, I've, I've always wanted to get the, I don't know if you guys have seen the Louis Vuitton ones, which I love, but I just find that they're too big and I don't really wear big hoops. I'm not really like a fan of them personally or myself. I think they look great on other people. Um, I saw Maya Jama wearing them, they looked so nice, but I managed to go into Fendi and find these with the perfect size. And yeah, win-win. These ones came to, I think these ones are around £270, which is steep. I know, but we move. We won't talk about it. Um, the next thing I got was this really cute Fendi ring. Um, so these are both come, they're both separate, the two separate rings, which you'll see in the unboxing that I do. They're just so elegant. Um, I love how simple they are. I'm not really a ring person, but I really wanted to get into rings and like wearing more jewellery. I tend to just stick to necklaces. For ages, I stuck to earrings. Um, recently got into necklaces as well, but these, I literally saw these rings and fell in love. They come as a two-piece set. I think these ones are around. <clears throat> I think these ones were around £170, which I thought was pretty good, especially for, which I thought was pretty good for like, designer um, jewellery section. Um, but yeah, super cute. I love it. I'm a fat. And the final thing that I got were these really cute uh, Fendi white trainers. I literally walked in the day that I went to buy the ring. I saw them on the side and I was obsessed. Oh, also, uh, when I spoke to, I spoke to the guy in Fendi, he actually said to me that that ring might actually be the first person to purchase that ring, so... I'm feeling a little hipster about that. So the final thing I got were these really cute Fendi trainers. They're the white embossed printed trainers. I literally saw them in store and absolutely fell in love. If you look at the back, it's got... At the back, they've got like a strip bit on there where you can actually get your name printed on. I was going to get that done, but just get my initials done on it which is actually complimentary to buying the shoes, but I ended up not because it was just going to take too long as I bought these the day before going into lockdown. They said that it would take a few days to do, they couldn't do it on time on that same day. So I'm probably just going to go back once lockdown is over in December and get them to do that. So comfortable. I literally tried them on and I was honestly in love with them. They're so comfortable. They've got a slight platform in them, which I wanted. I was looking for a pair of trainers that had like a slight bit of height in them once again. Not the tallest person, but they were cute. I really liked it. Got me all excited. I was like, oh, obsessed. I contemplated buying them. I was like, do you know what? Who cares? Who gonna stop me? Nobody. Just don't tell my mom and dad because they'll be mad that I'll be wasting my money. But yeah, so. Oh, oh it's, I'm gonna start looking a little too shabby, but we're gonna ignore that. But yeah. And that's it guys, thank you so much for joining me for this video, I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I'm definitely going to do a lot more, especially now that we're going into lockdown, I'm going to be rinsing online shopping. Um, but I will link everything that I bought in the comments down below so you guys can go check them out. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up, I'd really appreciate that. And if you'd like to see me do some more hauls or if there's any other videos that you'd like to see me do, please let me know down in the comments below and I will check them out and I'll spruce something up for you and not disappear for a whole hot month or two, however long I've been gone. Um, I'm gonna try and make this a little bit more consistent. See ya. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in my next video. outro with my cat too but he's not interested today <laughs> love you bye